previously on Close Friends. I just have to make sure she knows that I've moved on. But Kevin, it is Elise, you know? You can shed one tear. So that's how it's gonna be? Yeah! You made it that way! Did you hear anything about Kira and the baby? And if you continue on with this pregnancy, uh, you can lose your life. Alright, so, have you heard anything about Derek? Nah. Yo, what if he's dead? What if he's not? Can you just give this to him for me? Somebody got you a present? Malcolm? What's up, Cece? You miss me? Malcolm. Appreciate that, homie. I'm not your fucking homie. Oh, you a real funny ass dude, yeah, man. Yeah, whatever. Baby, I found the key. It seems like we fuss and fight for no damn reason. Our love goes hot and cold just like the seasons. I know you'd hate to see me walk away. But I have to take that step someday. I'll take you away from here. I'll take you. No, baby, won't forsake you. I need you in my world. Baby, the thing is that I need you. I can't see me without you. That's why you are. I just want to be wrapped up the round. I'm so caught up the things you. Val, can we please just talk? Look, I know I messed up. I can admit that. But I just want to talk to you. Can I please talk to Val? Look, Nate, she doesn't want to talk to you. If she did, I would have been let you in. Come on, Val. Val! We have neighbors. Man, forget your neighbors. Okay, we need to chill. Just let things go. Let things go? Are you acting like me and Val ain't been at it for like 15 years? How am I supposed to just let things go? I know, but give her some time to cope with everything that just happened. Nate, you know I got you. Give her a few days, and I'll, I'll let you know when it's the right time to talk to her. All right, I guess that's what I have to do. Things will get better eventually. Yeah, I hope. This whole thing is just crazy. What is? How did Tristan find out? The only people that knew was me, Tori, and you. And me and Tori had the most to lose, so... Wait, you trying to say that I said something? No, friends first. I'm not the type of person to do that. Nay, I don't break up happy homes. You sure? Yeah. You right. Oh, I'm tripping. I just gotta find out who told him. Man, sooner or later, the truth will come out. All right. But besides all that, how you been? I'm fine, just relaxing and taking the medicine that the doctor gave me and I should be back at top form. That's good to hear. And what about the baby? What happened? What happened? There's no baby. What? You wanted to see me, Alexis? Yes. Come in. Close the door, please. So, oh, you mix it. How do you know Raheem? 
you introduce me to him? I'm gonna ask you again. How do you know Raheem? Um, we met at a club a while back. Did you sleep with him? <laughs> what? I, I don't think this is a work-related question. You think? Listen, Raheem told me all about you and him. I know everything. So you sitting around here acting all naive like you don't know what's going on? That's bullshit. So if you woman enough to mess with another woman's man, the least you can do is own up to it and stop pussying around when you get caught. So if you come clean, I might go easy on you. Okay. Okay, we we had something. He broke it off. That's it, I promise. Oh really? That better be it. Now look here. I might not be able to fire you for sleeping with Raheem, but know this, any slip up, and I do mean any slip up, just know that that's your pink slip. What? Wait, no, 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 you can't, I need this job. I don't care what you need, just know this, I'm not one to play with. Do you understand me? I said, do you understand me? Yes, ma'am. Now, I have something for you. I want this on my desk by the end of this week. What? There is no way I could finish all this. There, there's no way anyone could finish all of this. I don't care. Just know, if that is not on my desk by the end of this week, you know what it is. Oh, you may leave. Oh, damn, my bad, Crystal. Crystal? What's wrong, Crystal? Dorian, what do you want? Now I have to go in on her like that. What did I have to tell you about being so nosy? Tell me whatever you want. Oh. I swear, if you don't get out of my office. Look, I apologize. You gotta forgive me. I can't really help myself in an environment like this with so many beautiful women. Maybe you should look into switching jobs. Nah, I think this. I think I'm in the perfect field. Then how do you expect to get things done? My work. My work been finished. So I'm thinking, now we can play. Get out of my office. Okay, but look, listen, I just wanted to- Get All right, but look, let's go check those numbers. Can I just go- I said number? get. Okay then, I'm not gonna fight you. Get out of my damn office. All right. Close my door. Okay. Bye, boss later. Hello? Don't hang up. What's up? I need your help with something. Hey, look. I already told you I don't got time to deal with you no more, right? So take care. Bye. Wait, wait, wait. Hear me out. All right, what? Alexa is trying to fire me. Okay, what you want me to stop her? Good luck, man. You on your own. I, I just need help finding a job. I know you work HR at your job, and having your name on my applications would do me wonders. Why don't you just quit before you get fired? I don't understand. That's damn near the same thing. Look, I just need this one favor, one time, and I promise I'll never, I'll leave you alone. All right. I'm going to help you out. But you got to understand, this is the last time. Don't call me, don't text me. Don't show up at my job, at my house, no nothing. At my friend's house, nobody. And that's it. You gotta promise me that. Okay, I promise. 
All right, good. We need to talk face to face. What? I have something I need to tell you. Hey, I'm done talking to you. Bye. Where my stuff at? Yeah, it's, uh, it's in the room. Well, how do you two? So you're not gonna say anything? What's there to say, Tori? I mean, I don't know. I just thought... Exactly. Now, excuse me. I got places to be. Oh yeah, um, I forgot something. What? I'm pretty sure I put everything in there. The ring. Are you serious? Yeah. You want something to drink? Um, yeah, a bottle of water is fine. What's Malcolm doing in our house? He just showed up out of nowhere. How did he even know where we lived? This is a completely new spot. I didn't tell him. I promise. Then how the hell did he get here? Karen from work told him. I hate her. She never wanted us to be together. So let me get this straight. When I wasn't here, he was here alone with you? Yeah, but nothing happened. Kevin, I promise. Are you lying to me? Look at me. Kevin, look at me. I worked so hard to get us back together. Do you think I would want to ruin that again? You believe me, right? Right? I don't know. But wait. Why would he come here, though? Didn't you guys break things off? We did. K kind of. Kind of? What do you mean, kind of? He went away on a six-month business trip, and I left to come back to you. Wow. So now the truth comes out. Your job didn't relocate you here. You just weren't getting the attention that you wanted. No, 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 no. Kevin, I always knew I messed up. I always knew I wanted to be with you. <laughs> Wait, where are you going? I'm going to my bed. Excuse me. Kevin. Kevin. Can you come back, please? Kevin. Can we talk this out like adults? I'm done talking. I just was coming over to check on you. I'm fine. Well, can I come in? Please? Anything I can help you with? 
Listen, I know the last time we seen each other, things were kind of crazy. I said some things I didn't mean. You don't deserve to be talked to like that. I'm sorry. Kira, Kira. You know I miss you, right? Marcus, stop bullshitting me. I'm not. The only reason why you're here is because you heard I lost the baby. Kira, I had no idea you lost the baby. I just thought you got in an accident. I'm sorry. No, you're not. You're just hiding your smile. This is what you wanted, right? No. Right? No, not like this. I wanted it to be your own decision. Cute. You always had a way of switching up your words to make you sound so much better. What are you talking about? Marcus, if you cared about me, why didn't you visit me in the hospital? I don't know. I almost died and you don't know? Fuck. I messed up. Yes. Yes, you did. Get the hell out of my house. What? Kira, listen. No. Let's Get talk out. about this. There's nothing to talk about. Look, I know you're upset right now. You just need some time to cool off. I don't need time. Look at me. I'm not giving up on us. You hear me? You done yet? Go. Hello, who's this? It's Geraldine. Who? Gigi. Oh, what's up? What are you doing right now? Nothing about to head to the gym. I have a big favor to ask from you. What's the favor? Can I get a ride to work, please? What happened to your car now? Um. It just keeps stalling for no reason. So, um, is that a yes? I got you since you're the homie. Really? I really appreciate it. Yeah. But, um, hey, you got a little bit of gas money? Really, Nathan? I mean, you're the homie and all, but you live uh, like the opposite direction. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. Just hurry up, please. All right, I'm coming. Hey, Val. What's going on? Not much. How you holding up? I'm good. Really, I, I can't complain. I don't know how you do it. Do what? This. You know, with everything that's been happening lately, and you still being able to show how it doesn't affect you. You know, I, I get a lot of that from my dad. You know, growing up, he just, he always seemed to keep his composure. I remember when I was little, you know, we got evicted from our apartment, and my mom was devastated. I, w I was too young to really understand what was going on, but we had to move. And I remember I looked at my dad, and he just looked like everything was going to be okay. And it was. You know, he just, he always seemed to be in control. Wow. That's very inspiring. Yeah. I feel dumb. Just any little thing that bothers me, I let it ruin my whole day. 
and you know lately I just I haven't been on my good foot losing trust in the people that I care about and then losing Elise I just I haven't been able to process that hey but listen you can't let things like that affect you people are always going to take advantage of that you think so yeah, trust me, I've seen it happen. Wow, I mean, I n I've never thought of it that way. All right, listen, enough of the war stories, all right? We're having a housewarming slash Halloween party. I want you to be there. All right, all right. sounds pretty good. I like Halloween parties. See, you already know. Hey, make sure you tell Kira too. You know, we gotta keep her in a positive vibe. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Oh, and Tori, of course. Yeah. Oh, y'all haven't made up yet? Oh, come, come on, on Val. Y'all too grown to be dealing with this high school drama. I know, but there's so much more no, to it. Listen, I don't care. Invite her to the party, and we're going to squash everything. Okay? Yeah. I'm serious. Invite her. I'm going to double check with you. Okay. All right. So listen. Starts at 8 p.m. If the guys ask, it's 7. Okay? Just because maybe this time they'll actually show up on time for a change. <laughs> All right? Smart move. Yeah. All right. So I guess I'll see you soon then? I'll see you around. It was great seeing you. Good seeing you too. Hey, take care of yourself, all right? You too. All right. Shoulders, baby. This smile for me. Now for these next few shots, I just want you to go crazy. Let your feelings flow. Uh, don't think about it, baby. Just relax a bit. She's trying to make the world. Uh, now grab your hair, huh? Hello? Why are you keep calling me, man? Look. You got me as your reference and that's it. You gotta stop calling me. Yeah, whatever, bye. Oh! Mm. Hey, you scared me. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to go to the bathroom. Oh. All right. Uh, throw it away, see my queen. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, my king. It's a joke, you know. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Hello? Gigi? Gigi? I'll be right out. I'm almost ready. All right. All right, cool. Hey, ain't you gonna be late for work? Huh? Aren't you gonna be late for work? I ain't worried about that. Why not? Because I don't work today. So, how's everything? No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. Keep that on. You're gonna be here for long. So what's up? What you wanna talk about? Did you get my letter? I got it. Like I said, what you wanna talk about? Um, I, uh, I... You what? Spit it out. I have something to tell you, but I'm not really sure how to say it. You grown. Say it, spit it out. Okay. Um, I. Uh, I. I know you're not pregnant. I know you're not pregnant. 
No, I'm not pregnant, Raheem. All right, good. I. What's the big deal? I. I have chlamydia. You what? You got chlamydia? So what you think? I gave it to you? No, no. It's my ex-boyfriend. He was always cheating on me. That's the reason why I broke up with him. I just, I just wanted to tell you just in case. You so, know. hold on. So you telling me you got it and then you gave it to me? That means a license. Look, if me or Alexis has it, I swear to God. The things you do, young lady, the type of shit you do will drive a young nigga crazy. Know exactly what you're doing now, baby. You walk around with your head held high. I know you're used to the easy life. You ask a nigga for something and he don't think twice. But if you're fucking with your boy, then you can't be lazy. You sit in little games and your words don't phase me. Bitch, don't act dumb or I will act crazy. That's just to let you know, don't play it all. Tonight, you'll at night. You either get left or you get right. I ain't gonna say that twice. I. I run of the street line, I run of the street line. <laughs> Leave your ass up under the street line.